Welcome to another episode of Carbs, the only show where I sit in the car and BS while consuming carbs. Matt Dine here. I'm a little zoomed in than normal because uh, it's nighttime filming and uh, the lights in general are like making the auto focus on this really bad. But uh, we are at Church's Chicken for the very first time. I've never had Church's Chicken. Uh, I didn't even know we had one around here. Uh, until I moved to uh, the, the place where I currently live, the city of Upland. Uh, and uh, when I was driving around, you know, looking for stuff, I saw one uh, like a couple years ago. And I was like, tonight's the night. Let's try it. They have a brand new handheld chicken pot pie. Uh, their website says, what makes our new handheld chicken pot pies taste so bold from top to bottom? Four words, crust in every bite. Warm. I try them now, only two for three dollars. Only got one of them, only need one. Uh, but essentially, this is a Hot Pocket. This is a Chicken Pot Pie Hot Pocket, which they actually sell. So, I mean, they have Hot Pockets. I'm, I'm like, do you think this is just a Hot Pocket? Um, no, I'm not, I'm not gonna say this is a Hot Pocket. It's a different size, well, maybe. It kinda looks more like the, uh, McDonald's pies as well, in terms of size, but. Alright, my first reaction to In Church's Chicken, maybe I should've actually done that, you know, trying their chicken, but. Gotta do what you gotta do, sucker. Oh, hot as hell. Woo! The, the deep fried batter, what, what would you even call that? What, this is right here, overall, they're right, the texture's great. The texture is awesome. Uh, it melds very well with the insides. I think they could use a little bit more uh, filling on the inside, or, or maybe like, I don't know if we could add some cheese or sauce to dip in something. It's a little dry. First bite was so good because it was so moist, ooh yeah. And then, like, it's still good, but it's it's starting to, I don't know, it's just not keeping up, I guess. It's just trying to drop in my mouth. That's strange. It started out so good. The first bite was amazing. Second bite was good, but not as good. And then the third bite, I was like, well, I'm kind of over it. I don't think I would get uh, two of those for $3. Uh, and I probably would never get another one again. Why? Well, that's so strange. That usually doesn't happen, where the first bite's so great, and it just degrades as you're going. Not bad item. Uh, it does remind me of a better quality Hot Pocket, probably because they fry it, uh, versus, you know, putting it in a microwave like a Hot Pocket. And, uh, yeah, it's, I think it's worth it. I mean, it's cheap. It's cheap sell. Two of those for $3. You can get the one for, like, a dollar or something. That is not gonna say back very much. Rating-wise, uh, I'm gonna give it a very solid 3 out of 5 matte faces. It's not, uh, something I would go out of my way for, but I wouldn't be opposed to having it, you know, if it was in front of me. Like, if I went to churches, I might grab that along with some chicken, so. And... If you want to see me go back and review straight up Church's Chicken, uh, let me know in the comments down below. And also, if you do like uh, Church's Chicken, what's the item of choice that you get whenever you go there? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching the handheld chicken pot pie, a uh, brand new item over at Church's Chicken. Go check that bad boy out. Uh, also, give this video a thumbs up. Go over onto Twitter and retweet if you liked what you saw. If you like what you see, call me. That was a reference to an old infomercial. Well, not infomercial, it was porn. It was like one of those sex hotline things. And uh, I just remember it was like the girls dancing around in Little Nighty. And then you shoot, the song would go, If you like what you see, call me. I wish, I wish that we had more on YouTube. It's totally random, random uh, ramble time. I wish we had more of those commercials, those sex hotline commercials from like the 90s when I was a kid. And I would stay up and shoot out a couple knuckle children all over the place. Uh, but I wish we had more of those, because like I found a couple of them on YouTube, but there's nowhere near. I mean, there were hundreds of those, and there's only maybe a handful of them that are uh, memorialized forever in YouTube infamy. But hey, there you go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry I talked about uh, sex hotlines. We'll see you soon. Bye. Logan. Uh, what's funny is I'm not like super scared of this game, but it's very uncomfortable. That baby, come on. Now. Ah! Alright, well, fair enough. I guess I talk, you talk shit, get hit. <laughs> <laughs>